Fife Flyers TV, sponsored by the Bay Hotel, Fife's premier wedding venue. Scott Jemison, you must be buzzing tonight after your first goal for the for the Fife Flyers. Yeah, definitely. It feels good to get my first goal, but it was quite sad to not get the win. So uh, just kind of sort of talk us through that, that goal, how it came about, you know, um, how you got, got the puck past him. Yeah, I was at the face-off and my, my guy just kind of left me, so uh, just went round, drive the net and Smitty made a good pass and just stuffed it in the net. And it was great, and right? Was it right between his, his legs yeah, through the pads? Yeah, right between the legs, yeah. Um, so yeah, so I mean that's four games now for uh, for the Flyers. Logged a lot of ice time out there as well. Just how's it how's it felt? It's felt good. It's good to get the experience as a young guy. Obviously, it's a lot faster pace than the Kessels that I'm used to, but it's good to get the experience and see where it takes me. I know that um, the coaches have uh, have kind of challenged you and all of the young guys coming into the team to to kind of sort of take your get your level up as, as high as possible. Um, what have you been doing just to kind of sort of get to that point? Well, I need to be training hard in the gym all, all summer and keep the conditioning up and just keep working hard and do, do all the little things and just keep going. But the the four guys who've been playing out in Australia are coming back this uh, this week, yeah. so it's going to be harder to get a um, you know a, a slot on the ice. Do you think you've you've done enough to to merit that? Well, maybe, yeah, it just depends what Todd says and obviously I'll keep working hard as I always do and the four guys will come in, they'll be key to the lineup. Um, and of course next weekend, get the clan in, in this building. Um, what, what are you expecting out of that game? What do you think it's going to be like playing in, in, uh, in front of all of them? It'll be a big atmosphere because I've been to these games before as a fan and it'll be a big atmosphere, I just can't wait. You, uh, have you, have, have they, uh, they spoken to you about kind of sort of almost keeping calm in those situations, you know, when you've got the crowds on top of you? Yeah, some, a lot of while, yeah, they have, but uh, just kind of need to stay composed and just focus what's going on on the ice. You're on a two-way contract uh, this season with the, with the Kestrels as well. Um, what's, uh, what's it like in the, the Kestrels with uh, a lot of the old Flyers guys coming back? It's good to have them because they've been there, done that, and it's good to kind of have them to give you a hand and it's good to have the experience behind you for a young person. You, uh, you're learning a lot of the guys? Yeah, definitely, yeah. Um, and uh, and, and what, do you, what do you see for the Kestrels this season? Do you, you reckon the silverware for them? Yeah, there's potential there for silverware. We just need to keep working hard. We've a lot of new faces in, a lot of new faces out, and we'll just see where it takes us. Brilliant. Well, listen, we're looking forward to seeing what you can do this season, and thanks for speaking to us. Thank you very much. The Bay Hotel, where your dream wedding becomes reality. Visit us at thebayhotel.net.